Hello and welcome to another edition of Investing for Generations. And today I want to talk about another stock out of my portfolio. And this time uh, it's also stock which is in the portfolio of Warren Buffett. And it is American Express. So we will talk about the history of American Express, about the financial numbers, about the management, uh, about the se sector at all. And then I will give you my view if American Express is a buy right now or not. So let's start. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe, like, share and comment. Thank you. American Express was founded in 1850. It's best known for its credit cards and before even for the traveler's checks, which was really, really uh, famous. Um, and also the brand of American Express is a very uh, famous brand and it's named as the 27th most valuable brand in the world. Here we can see it's a number 27 as I said and uh, just two behind uh, Visa, one behind Walmart. So a very good company over there with a very very strong brand. What's also very interesting is that uh, the Fortune magazine ranked American Express as number nine on their list of the top 100 companies to work for. And that's really also a good sign for me. Uh, I think every time when the people like to work for a company, that shows also that maybe there is something special in this company, something special in a good way. Uh, at all they are working uh, almost 60,000 people for American Express right now. And also Warren Buffett bought American Express in 1963, so almost 60 years ago. And it is still the fourth lar largest position in his portfolio. But then dive into the financial numbers. American Express pay a small dividend of 1.84% right now with a nice payout ratio of 56.98%, which is not too high, not too low. Around the 60% area, I really like this, uh, with a nice growing over the last five years of 10%. With American Express, we also see a grow in the revenue over the last five years. It's 5.5% over the last five years. And all of this market of the non-cash transactions um, just growing very fast and it will even grow more in the future and maybe not so much uh, in Europe and North America but a lot in Asia, uh, Latin America. The emerging market markets just grow in this area very fast and this is far from, from ending. So and with this also American Express will grow his revenue because they have a very good uh, market position uh, here in this non-cash transactions. Also American Express work on very good margins, um, very stable margins. Net margin is always around 10 to 15 percent. Um, also the operating margin is between 15 and 20 percent over time um, and that's very good, very stable. Uh, they just earn money all the time. And we can also see the same here with a free cash flow, uh, which also um, grew over the last five years, 10% um, per year. And also the shareholder equity builds up over time. Um, so I think we see here a lot of reasons why also Warren Buffett likes his American uh, Express position. Also the balance sheet is solid. Um, we have a good current ratio. Also, the debt equity ratio is okay, it's not perfect, but you also have to remember that we are in the financial sector and the difference to MasterCard or Visa is that American Express is not just the processor, it's also the borrower of the money, of the credits. And so, as we see it also at the banks, um, of course, the debt equity ratio uh, looks different than in other, uh, other companies because just debt is one of the business models um, that these companies have. Then take a look at the management. The current CEO of American Express is Steven Squarey. And as I really liked it, and as I said before in my other analysis of, of the other stocks, 
um, I really like if somebody stick with the company for a long time and here as a CEO is with the company for 34 years this is almost my whole life uh, and he is a CEO since 2018 this is really a big relation between the company and this man so I really like this and I think the company is in very good hands with this CEO let's take a look at the price American Express is currently traded at 93.42. Um, my calculated intrinsic value is around $100. And so the margin of safety right now is around 6%. Um, I was able to buy American Express in the depth of the market crash in March and April. Uh, on the 14th of April and the 20th of April for an average price of $86.58. So I'm a little bit up right now and I'm very happy with my position and we are still under the intrinsic value, so that's good. And if the market will drop again, um, I will maybe even add more to my shares. Um, we will see what happened there. For the moment, I'm just happy with that. So what's my conclusion then? With American Express, we have a company with a very strong brand and a strong position in a growing market. And with very high and stable cash flows. That's very positive and um, that's, I think, one of the reasons why Warren Buffett holds this company for almost 60 years now. And I think he has also no reason to sell anywhere soon. The negative, of course, is a lot of these companies out of the financial sector uh, are there looming recession and maybe also depression and uh, with that American Express have a little bit higher risk uh, because as I said before they are not just the processor like all the other credit card companies they are also the borrower of the money so this makes the risk a little bit higher but after all I think American Express is just a great business a great company and I'm very happy to be an owner of the great company. So that's it for today. If you liked the video, subscribe, ring the notification bell so you will never miss another video and give me a big thumbs up. I'm very happy about this and already I reached 65 subscribers and I will give a big thank you to every one of you. Uh, that's very exciting and I hope you help me just to grow this channel even more. And uh, so see you the next time then with my second largest stock in my portfolio. Take care. Bye bye. See you soon.